So an Australian scientist claims to have solved the mystery of the Bermuda Triangle once and for all. Carl Kruzelnicki, a fellow at Sydney University, has ascertained that supernatural causes aren't at play and the disappearance of planes and boats over the years is likely down to bad weather and human error. Located between Miami, Puerto Rico and Bermuda, over the years many planes and ships are reported to have vanished without trace near the North Atlantic region, which covers 700,000 kilometers of ocean. Carl Zelnicki has theorized that due to the Bermuda Triangle being a busy patch of sea, he points to its proximity to the US. Disappearances in the area aren't that unusual. Kruzelnicki told News.com Australia back in 2017, and I quote, It is close to the equator, near a wealthy part of the world, America. Therefore, you have a lot of traffic. According to the Lloyds of London and the US Coast Guard, the number that goes missing in the Bermuda Triangle is the same as anywhere in the world on a percentage basis. Flight 19 was made up of five planes that took off from Fort Lauderdale, Florida on 5th of December 1945 with a total of 14 crew members on board. According to claims, a PBM Marine Seaplane dispatched on a search and rescue mission to find Flight 19 also disappeared, as did the 13 crew members on board. Cruz Zalniki insists that vanishing of Flight 19 was likely down to the 15-meter waves knocking about the Atlantic that day, despite reports of ideal flight conditions on 5th December 1945, he also noted that Lt. Charles Taylor, the flight's leader, was the only experienced pilot out of the five. Although it may have been an error in Taylor's own judgment that sealed their fate, Kruzelnicki transcripts show Taylor was convinced his plane should fly east. A junior pilot suggested they turn west, but Taylor overruled and the petrol continued east further into the Atlantic. Kruzelnicki explained that this part of the ocean is particularly deep, making wreckage recovery more difficult. As for the search and rescue seaplane, Kruzelnicki said it was seen blowing up in the air. What are your thoughts? Thanks for watching.